expression. Now, the Vikings inspire fans in many different ways. The game of football lends itself to an artistic expression. Robert Blayhart was one of those impressionable youths when the Vikings took over the town in the 1970s. When he grew older, he realized he had a gift to, in some respects, recreate it. He grew up in St. Paul, the Vikings fan, and he became a renowned artist, featuring in part the Vikings. I go back, you know, to the Tarkenton, Foreman, Joe Cap days, you know, and, and um, so I've always, you know, been a big Vikings fan. And in 2008, I was very excited. The Vikings took my Adrian Peterson poster and they gave that out at a game to 60,000 fans. And that, that poster, I still, I, I'll find people that'll tell me they've got that poster from just all over the place and it's just you know it's just a nice feeling it was the golden era of vikings football that set the tone when he cared much about the super bowl losses and more i would always be out playing football on on viking sunday playing in the snow you know with friends and then i'd hear the viking score and and it, and it just had there was something about the feel of a sunday back then it was just nothing like it he's not just about football he's about minnesota sports if it captivates him he puts it to canvas i did a painting of Armin killebrew who was absolutely my boyhood hero and um this was back probably about 25 30 years ago and later on the twins took that painting and they displayed it at the mentor dome behind i think it was gate fg or h or something like that for a few months and uh that's more or less what started me in the in the sports realm, I, I mean, I've been a sports nut my whole life. What does it mean to to uh, be able to create those figures when it is connected to you because it's your boyhood team? There's nothing like it. I mean, I've done a lot of paintings for a lot of people all over the world, you know, but there's nothing like going back to my Minnesota roots. I mean, it, it definitely has a special place in my heart. And uh, yeah, there's nothing like it. So you can find his work at robertblair.com. Good stuff.